The president is heading to Pittsburgh today following one of the worst instances of anti-Semitic violence in U.S. history. Two News' Kelly King is live with the divide he faces, plus how people here in the Miami Valley are trying to help the Jewish community heal. The president and first lady are set to arrive around 4 o'clock in the Squirrel Hill community in Pittsburgh. That's where they'll pay their respects after 11 people were gunned down at the Tree of Life Synagogue Saturday. But the president faces an uneasy welcome. Hundreds of thousands of people have signed an open letter posted online to the president telling him he's not welcome in Pittsburgh and asking him to, quote, stop targeting and endangering all minorities. On Saturday, President Trump condemned the shooting as pure evil and said all forms of hate must be rejected. Meanwhile, across the country, rabbis and other religious leaders are trying to help the Jewish community cope. That includes right here in the Miami Valley. Rabbis at Temple Beth Or in Washington Township say several members have come together to offer each other comfort. There was an extra amount of room for our congregants to imagine this could have been us. Um, so I think there's just been a lot of a lot of need to process those emotions. The Jews have been a strong people and they've lived through a lot and we will survive and live through this too and the best way to do that is to reach out to our allies and our friends and the peaceful members of the community. A gathering for all community members will be held tonight to reflect and stand in solidarity with those mourning in Pittsburgh. It will take place at 7 o'clock at Temple Israel in Dayton. Kelly King, 2 News Today, working for you.